你好，我们是全杰科技，我是高金海，我们现在开始为您做教学展示。Now I want to show how to find KM and the VMAX and the standard error a r c and p v a for hands w a l l fit. It's a m i c r o m e t e r in enzyme kinetic. Okay. This data is the source data from the paper. And the sub subtract x here and the velocity v here. Okay. And now we are focused on this section. This is the paper's result, and it have its k and v and v max and the regressions r square and the probability p value. Okay. Now I enlarge the image. Okay. Now I hope we can use the schema plot to fit perfect. Okay. This is the formula. Oh, okay. A m i c r o s m e t m e n t o n equation. Okay. Because hence w a l l fit is the transformation like the following. Okay. So we can deny a uh, linear equation. Okay. This is the uh, data. From the paper, uh, data is quite simple. Just the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and x and y. First one we use the transform for x and y. Okay, use the previous uh, uh, transform for x and y. After transform, the the new x and y put on the fourth and fifth column. Here, four and fifth column here. Okay, you should transform one. This this transform in the you already did put in the schema plot. Okay, if our customer, you can we can send you send to you. Okay, and then we use the use the defined regression. Okay, you can see the formula here, and of course you must put the x and y correctly. In column four and in column five, and then you can see the results. And come to compare the paper, it's quite the same. Okay, and K M and V mix. Okay, and then when you create a report, okay, you can also it's regression R square here, R square here, and the probability P value here. If you use the <coughs> real case, okay. Now the subtract here, but they have a three replicate. But in our design, you must rearrange your data into two single column. First one is for x, and second one is for y. Because for regression, it's completely the same. The result is completely the same. Okay. And still, you have to transform your data. Okay. Now the new data, uh, new x y put in fourth and fifth column. Okay. And use the user defined linear regression. You can see the R square and V max and its standard error K and V max and the p value. Okay. Now I will show you how to do in the schema plot. Okay. Now it's the data. Sorry, it's the data from from paper. Okay. Now first use transform one. The current current four and the current five. Press run. Okay. And then press the this user defined equation. Please please remember now x become the current four and the y is current five and Press next. Now you can see the result. Okay, you press next. Okay, create report. Okay, now you can see the report here. And the R square is here. Okay, and the uh, Vmax coefficient and its standard error also Km, and also you can find the the p value here. Okay, now we 
I will show you uh, for real case. Okay, this is a real case, but actually in the exterior like this. But we just need this data, okay? And we range your data like this one, okay? And still the same. You transform one and press run. The data put in fourth and fifth column. Use hands wall the user defined regression. Okay, now it's column four for x, column five for y, and next the result. Create report. Okay. So you can see the R square here and uh, Vmax and KM here and it's standard error. Also P value here. Okay, thanks for your watching. Goodbye.